This is the best time that I've had on this entire trip in 14 months of traveling, 36 states. Florida takes the cake. If you get anything out of this channel, I hope it's this. Do things that frighten you because little do you know, it likely will turn into a situation that's gonna blow your mind and you're gonna be like, wow, I can't believe I almost didn't do this. And that has been Florida for me. I can't believe I almost didn't come here because I have a very strong feeling that Florida is gonna have a really important place in my life and in my heart for a lot of years. I just feel it. And I almost missed out on this opportunity because I was afraid that the dogs and I were gonna be too hot and it's beautiful weather. And I know it gets warmer here very soon, but I'm, I'm really thinking that we're gonna be able to pull this off. We're gonna find a little piece of land and I'm gonna be able to start just a, a little bit of a homestead, something small, just a starter place. And I really think it's gonna happen here in Florida. Bios, Davis, getting all the attention so from the good. ladies. <laughs> Wade and Robin that just hooked me up with some really cool spots. So oh, I'm super excited. They recognize the Bronco. Oh, yeah. They recognize the Bronco with the really doggies. Nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you, guys. too. The best gift that a girl could ever ask for. <laughs> water pump? You're funny. He brought me a water pump. <laughs> I don't know if I want to admit that that is part of the sweet game. She also needs rear end lube. He's going to lube my rear end real quick. I mean, I've never touched that. I didn't even, this is my first time knowing about this. You grab the wheel here, you grab it here and do this, see? Yeah. Listen to this, plug, plug. Yeah, that's not good. No. It's not, it, maybe it's just not all the way on there? No. No, <laughs> no you need new wheel bearings. Okay. And these are not, these are not hard. Uh, positive Brett over here, giving me some uh, pointers on how to make my headlights brighter. That's right. Do what we can to make this Bronco the best. Uh huh. Broncos are number one. How did you know I needed some brighter headlights? Hot guy in a van. Yeah, I found a hot guy that has a van. Finally talked to him. He brought me a fruit parfait. Lisa, it worked. <laughs> Lisa was like, You need to go up to. I was like, How do I introduce myself? She was like, You need to go up to that boy and be like, Yeah, my YouTube channel wants me to get a van. Can you let me tour yours? <laughs> I did exactly that, Lisa. Look at me now, eating fresh fruit parfaits. <laughs> My knee's humping again. At the park, walking the dogs in my bikini top still. I have my pants on to make me a little bit more comfortable, but it just feels so good. I love this. I forgot that Florida is uh, tropical heat and it's not a dry heat like California. So I'm in love right now. I feel like I'm on vacation. It's just bringing back all the memories of Hawaii. Oh, I love it. I, I, this is, I love this. <laughs> the sun's about to go down. So I have to film this really quickly. I'm in the Bronco. We just spent the day at the beach. I know a lot of you spent the day with me because we were doing a live stream. And first of all, I would just like to say thank you to all of you that have been supporting me and coming along for this journey. And, writing me emails and giving me advice and you know pointers and help and just support I can't tell you how much it means to me you all have changed my life drastically and it you have all pierced my heart so I just want to say that real quickly thank you so much thank you for all of you that are my patreons thank you to all of you that donate to my super chats and give me money like I've been saving every single penny that you guys have been giving me and so that we can hopefully buy a piece of property here very soon. And it looks like we're just like almost there. We just need to find the land now. So I just wanted to say thank you from the bottom of my heart for being here. Thank you. Anyways, we've really just been soaking up the sun. The dogs are really happy. I'm doing really good. And um, yeah, I've, I've told you guys that I feel like I'm getting a little bored of traveling around. I've been to a lot of places and I'm looking for a project. and. I think that that needs to just be a homestead. We need to start, we need to have some place to land, especially right now with the Bronco acting up, like we need to get a place to land. So I don't wanna just be paying mechanics to work on my Bronco. I'd like to be doing it myself. So we just need a little home base. And I, I think that that's gonna be Florida, you guys. 
I'm gonna try. So I'm putting this out there. If any of you are real estate agents or maybe some of you have land for sale or know of somebody that have land for sale, my email address is contactmorgan at unstoppablemorgan.com. Please hit me up, let me know. You guys always come through for me, so please help me. Let's go start looking at some property. Um, I'm, I need something cheap, but uh, like I said, just some, like a starter place, a couple acres, I would like something more than 10 acres if that's possible. Anyways, email me if you know of anything and if this is meant to be, we'll see, but let's try. I can't believe I'm making this video. I'm gonna cry. I just can't even believe we're here. We're here. We're actually finally here. Let's go find some land. And so I just feel something here. I feel like I should be here. I don't know what it is. There's something about this place that is magical. I think it's because it feels so much like Hawaii. And I always wanted to live my life in Hawaii from a very young age. And I screwed that up. I royally screwed that up. And um, I always regretted leaving Hawaii. And I tried so many times to go back, to move back there and to rebuild my life there. And it just never worked. And I don't know, I just, something about here feels like I'm home. And I really thought it wasn't going to be, I never thought it was going to be Florida. Never in a million years. Something feels like home here. So let's go find a home. <laughs> Super nice to be able to shower, not having to find a truck stop is awesome. Oh, it's so refreshing. Yes. <laughs> okay, I went to Whole Foods because I'm gonna try to eat healthier. But I got the dog something special since Scotty wanted me to do that. Oh, you wanna see what Scotty bought you? One of your big fans. Oh, gonna give you guys a rib. Oh, yeah. One for Bougie. I have to wash all the blankets in here today, so go for it, guys. Can you stay on this blue one, though? Chop up some chicken, give it to these pups that are so hungry, y'all. Oh, I know. Are you hungry, Mr. Miles Davis? Anyways, I love it here. I'm having a great time. I'm meeting amazing people. Uh, incredibly hot men everywhere I look. Yeah, very fun. <laughs> and really nice couples. And I'm going to dinner tonight with a really sweet couple. You'll see them in the video in this one and in another one. But, um... Things are going really well. I'm getting a lot of help with the squeaking sound. I think it's the water pump, so I'm gonna change out this water pump. Um, yeah. Coming here, this is the best place to come right here to relax. It know? is, it's it is. Best. How long have you two been living here again? Since, um, 82 oh. for me. Wow. Yeah. Since I was seven. What made you come to Florida? My dad was in, it's funny, he's from Alabama. He was, we were in the Air Force. Right? Yeah. I was born in Ohio, right past the Air Force Base. Uh -huh. and he's like, you want to move to the beach? I'm like, what? And so he came down here to work as a best director of rocket science. He's real smart. I don't know what happened to me. But anyways, <laughs> so we moved down here and then she came down. Um, I was from Philadelphia and my mom just wanted a better life for us. So um, she had health problems and my aunt lived down here and said, you guys need to move down here for the sunshine. Wow. So we moved down here and that's I've awesome. been here ever since. Right? I'm yep. thinking about staying. I think <laughs> this is a great place. It was very good parfait. Parfait, man. It's where it's at. It's such a fancy word. Parfait. Dogs are passed out. Buddy, Bougie, Miles Davis. <laughs> What'd you find there, Bougie Bougie? Oh, this was a bad idea. Why did I bring everything that's important to me down to the sand? Because you guys have to walk on all of my stuff. I mean, look at this. Thank you. Oh, I just want to sit next to Mama. Okay. Why are these zippers open? Oh, 
power supply, laptop. I'm gonna try to edit. Can you? I can't have anything nice. Nothing. I just bought this towel, you guys. Come on, dude. Guys, all right, let's get to work. Edit a video, Morgan. Edit a video.